Hi, this is Sherry at the Intentional Home Podcast, where I share tips and resources to help you live with intention and purpose. This is episode number 13, and today we're going to be talking about teaching your children important life skills. Now, before we begin, I do have to apologize. I've been battling a cold, so my voice is not the best, so I hope I can get through this podcast today. But there is something really exciting exciting that I wanted to share with you today, so I didn't want to skip this week, so bear with me and bear with my voice. I apologize again. So as we look at life skills and teaching our kids life skills, I want to start by telling you a little story, and then I'm going to get into the exciting part of this amazing resource that you can use. Now, I have five children, as most of you know, and I'm a perfect example of how sometimes things can slip by me without even realizing it. My youngest son has always, up until maybe a couple years ago, has always had shoes that used Velcro to close them. And I don't really remember why he just liked that style. And it seemed like there were always some really cute ones to choose from. So we just ended up getting those most of the time when we got shoes for him. And you can probably guess where I'm going with this. But one day, a couple years ago, my son outgrew his shoes. And my older son had some, it was his dress shoes, actually, I think his nicer shoes for church. And my oldest son had some shoes that were in pretty good shape still that he'd grown out of. So I pulled them out and gave them to my youngest for him to wear. But the only problem was they were laced up shoes. They weren't Velcro. And my son promptly told me that he didn't know how to tie his shoes. I couldn't believe it. How had I failed my son so badly in this very basic and important life skill? I had forgotten somewhere along the line to teach him how to tie his shoes. Now, at the time it happened, it, it really kind of took me back, um, and I, I took it kind of hard. But looking back now, I, I realized that I needed to give myself some grace and to realize that things like these can slip by us, and we just forget about them or we don't realize them. And I think sometimes the more children you have, the easier it is to let things slip by, and we just don't realize. So I set my son down, showed him how to tie his shoes, and with a few days' practice, he had it down. No big deal. But that experience made me realize that teaching life skills is an area that we as parents really do need to be intentional about. And life gets busy and many times we fail to teach these skills to our children. Or if you're like me, um, I don't know if it's just my personality, but I tend to just do things for other people. I think I'm a, I'm a, have a servant heart, and so I tend to just do things and not realize that I am failing to pass these responsibilities on to my children and teach them how to do them. And so um, teaching life skills is what we're going to be talking about today, and I wanted to share that story just as a little bit of a backstory um, of how things like this can happen. The life skills that we want to teach our kids sometimes can slip through the the, the through the cracks and we just forget about them and they they go by us. Now, the exciting thing I want to share with you today is a tool that, oh, maybe a couple months ago I was um, introduced to, maybe it's been longer than that, but it's called SkillTrek. And what SkillTrek is, it is a subscription service. So I can't remember what their different options are. I think you can sign up by the month or by the year. They might even, I think they even have a lifetime um, where you can just pay one fee for your whole family for life. But it's a subscription service. And when you have an account, you have access to all of their life skills lessons. They have lessons on three different levels. So if your children are different ages, they can work on skills that are geared towards their level. Um, and what I what I love about it too is that it not only helps your child build their life skills, but it works on their character too. Um, it gives them confidence and they're building their character as they're working on these skills. Some of the things that they cover 
They cover life skills like financial literacy, gardening, swimming, technology, recreation, calendar holidays, emergency preparedness, health, child care, current events, outdoors, organization, manners and etiquette, crafts, maintenance, hygiene, housekeeping, cooking, good character. Those are just a few. There's so many different things that they have. I can't even remember how many life skills um, segments they have in their library now, but it is a lot. So when you create your account with SkillTrack, when you pay for um, a subscription, you can set up accounts for each of your children. You can set up one of the levels for them to work on. And then as a parent, you can go in and you can customize the things that you want your kids to work on. So you can go in and select the life skills that you want them to be focusing on for the next, you know, maybe the next week or the next couple of weeks. And as they work on them, what it, what it is, is they, when they click on this skill for them to work on, there's usually a short video for them to watch that teaches the skill. And then there's a PDF file that you can print out that has the information on what the skill is and what they're learning. And then it has a challenge, something that they need to accomplish to show that they have mastered that skill. And so, and then once they've completed their skill, then they can, um, they get badges or stickers, depending on if you're doing the online, they have an online version and then they have, I think they still have an offline version, but anyway, um, they get rewards for um, earning, um, for accomplishing skills, and it kind of gives them that motivation to keep going. So that is kind of what Skill Trek is. It's a wonderful resource. If you're like me, um, it, it's a wonderful way for you to get some of those skills out um, in front of you as a parent and helping your kids be more intentional and in working on those. So what Skill Trek is doing, and this is the exciting thing I wanted to share with you, they are doing a free four-week family challenge, and it's going to start this Saturday, April 28th, and once the challenge starts on Saturday, you will not be able to sign up um, for this challenge. I think their plan is to do um, some more challenges throughout the year, so this is their very first one, and so they're going to give this a try and see if this helps, but they wanted to offer a way to get families a chance to experience skill track, to have kind of some hand holding. The, the owners um, of skill track are going to be presenting live videos. I think there's a Facebook group that you're going to be a part of. And I signed up for this for our family as well, just because I think it's going to be fun. But they will kind of walk you through and hold your hand and kind of introduce you to the program. They'll help you um, be accountable. I think that they said they're going to send you the skills like each week. And then there's going to be some checkups where we come back and we talk about what we worked on and how the kids did. And, um, and the thing that's neat about it is that the skills that they have chosen for this are not anywhere in their current library. These are brand new skills that nobody has seen yet. And they're skills that um, the whole family can work on. So it's not just something the kids can do. The parents, you guys can get involved as well. So one of the skills that they have shared that they're going to be covering is the importance of an evening routine. So this is something, you know, that would be kind of, that's an interesting, it's a skill that we need to learn. And sometimes we don't think about it. And so anyway, that's just one example of one of the skills that they're going to be covering. And you know, a lot of us are winding down our school year, um, gearing up for the summer. And what a better way to do this challenge together as a family and to um, spend some of these more relaxed days, maybe during the summer break, um, working together as a family on some of these new skills. And it would be just a great way if you are not a current life skill uh if you do not currently have a life skill account or a life skill skill trek account, um, this would be a great way for you to try it out and to see. Um, it doesn't cost anything. You simply just, um, I'll give you the link here in a little bit, but you simply just go and sign up with your email and then they will send you all the information when the challenge starts. So um, you don't have to put in any credit card information or anything. 
It's totally free, but it does give you a chance to give Skill Trek a try and to see if it's something that would work for your family. One of the neat things that they're going to do too is they're actually going to um, be sharing how families are incorporating Skill Trek into their lives. Now, um, we all know that it's fun to have a really neat, you know, cool tool like this to use, but if you can't figure out how to incorporate it into your family life, then it really isn't going to do any good. Um, a tool is only good if, if you use it. So one of the cool things during this challenge is they're going to be um, sharing how families are incorporating this, you know, what they are doing to make it a part of their life and to um, make sure that they are working on those life skills. So if this sounds like something that you would be interested in, you can go to this link. It's sherrygram.com forward slash skill trek and it's S-K-I-L-L-T-R-E-K. And I will put um, that link will be on my uh, on the show notes on that blog post. If you want to go there, you can get that link as well. But go there, sign up for the challenge. Again, if you do not sign up before Saturday, you won't be able to get in on this challenge. Um, they'll be doing another one later, but um, I would just encourage you. This is a perfect time to give this a try and see if it's something that your family would love and um, something that your kids would enjoy too as they build their confidence, as they're building their skills um, to be prepared for life. So that is all I wanted to talk about today. Um, thank you again for bearing with me. Um, I think my voice made it through, but I just want to thank you for joining me and encourage you to check out my other podcasts. You can find all the information about my podcast and show note links and all that good stuff on my website at sherrygram.com forward slash podcast. Thank you and have a wonderful day.